The campground we're camping at is right next to this trailhead to the most popular trail in the Bitterroot National Forest, which is Blodgett Canyon Trail. And that's what we're gonna do today. It's a little smoky from the wildfires, but not too much to where it's gonna be unhealthy for us to hike. And we're hoping it'll clear up eventually. It's about a 10 mile hike, but it only has an elevation gain of 1500 feet. So it's not gonna be too bad, we don't think at least. But um, we'll see, you never know. Whenever you see a mama moose and a baby moose, just back away, get out of their way. I'm really glad we had this rock we could climb up on because she came down right where we were standing. That was scary. <laughs> moose are cool, but they're pretty aggressive. They can be, and they're big, man. We just ran up on this boulder. Oh God, that was scary. It's like the biggest boulder we've seen this in the whole forest too. So I was lucky. Yeah, I'm glad that we met them here and not somewhere else. Because this trail is really narrow. Yeah, we just came around the tree right there in the middle, and she was standing up by the other tree behind that. Right above us, and we were clearly crossing paths with where she wanted to go, because she got real aggressive and put her feet out like this. I thought it was a, a horse at first. <laughs> I was like, hmm. For me, it's almost as scary to see a moose as it is to see a bear, especially when they have a calf. <laughs> I don't know why, but I've just always been told about how aggressive they can be, so I'm just like very careful around them. It's just because I'm Swedish that they keep coming around. Oh, that's true. They know. They know and they are like, oh. They're just out here to protect me. This is the rock. The rock that saved us. Good morning. We are back in Idaho. Uh, this is the Salmon River. We left Hamilton a couple of days ago and started heading pretty much straight south. It took us about two hours to get down here and uh, we're currently staying at this Morgan Bar Recreation Site. It's a $5 a night campground. 
which is really cheap. You don't have any hookups or anything like that, but you get to be right by the river. So that's really nice, so we can go fishing every morning and evening. Today we're going to explore the town of Salmon. It's not a very big town, but it felt a little bit touristy when we drove through it. So we want to get a feel of the town and see if we can find some good lunch, maybe. Well, right now we're going to go get some food in Salmon, Idaho at this, uh, I don't know, it's like a cafe sandwich shop drive through thing. It's mostly, it's like they've got coffee, of course, and then it's just like wraps, actually. A lot of different wraps and sandwiches. We're gonna go check that out and then maybe see the town a little bit. It's been a little iffy since the smoke here has been so bad. We haven't been able to be outdoors and hiking as much as we've wanted, we've wanted to be. So that's kind of sad, but we can always walk around town and this place has got some cool stuff, like they've got the Salmon River and this is supposed to be like the area where Sacagawea was born, so they've got this whole cultural center for that, so we're going to check that out. Fries. I read a review that said that this place had the best fries, and they were not kidding. That is two dollars for this huge bag of fries. There's more down in here. What else you got? Here's your bacon cheeseburger wrap. Yeah, I promised Jenny's grandma to never stop eating bacon cheeseburgers. So I got a bacon cheeseburger wrap. <laughs> and then I got a chicken salad wrap. And that fry sauce. All right, let's dig in. So what's inside a chicken salad wrap? Chicken salad wrap. <laughs> no, it's, it's got all the like cranberries and nuts in it, like a lot. Like they didn't skimp out and a ton of dressing. It's really excellent quality, I'd say. And the cheeseburger wrap has uh, lettuce, cheese, uh, hamburger, bacon. Yeah, just like a cheeseburger. They had this drink called the London Fog I really wanted to try. That's like Earl Grey tea with honey and whipped cream and vanilla. I might have to go back and get that. I mean, I would definitely recommend the Baker's, the Baker Shack if you come through Salmon. It's good food. 